My life as a vlog is very creative. It has a really good message, but I didn't really enjoy it. This is the 12th episode of the 34th season of The Simpsons. This is directed by Debbie Mayen, and it's all about The Simpsons having their own successful family vlogging channel. But it's mostly told through the perspective of other people. And there is a mystery surrounding them, the, the family, and honestly, that, that's about it. It's really boring. The actual narrative is very dull. And the family last posted content however many days ago, and certain other people are trying to track them down. And it, it's as dull as it sounds. It really is. Actually seeing the family vlogs... The vlogs themselves were really, really boring, but let's be honest, a lot of family vlogs are. But the way it was done, the way it was animated, I really liked. It was very creative. Visually, it was really appealing, really engaging, and it did poke fun at certain styles of vlogging and certain types of YouTubers. And it is YouTube. It's not a parody of YouTube. It is actually YouTube, which I thought was uh, pretty interesting. Normally, they would try and change the name a bit. And it does parody certain things. So that kind of relatability of, you know, laughing at certain things that make me roll my eyes in real life. Yeah, that was fine. But other than having a slight element of relatability, I just, I didn't find it interesting. The actual narrative was boring. If they'd gone with a different direction, it could have been okay. I can't offer a suggestion. I have no idea what could have been a better narrative. But the point there being is that I think the problem is the story of this whole, why haven't they posted content? Where are they? Where's their house? What's the Simpsons family doing now? It just was so dull. And I don't know why they thought this was a good idea because it's not, it's not interesting. And I feel like it could have been. It could have been interesting, but it just fell flat pretty quickly. I think once I got over the novelty of this different style, then it started to go downhill. Yes, I like the fact that I was making fun of certain kinds of vloggers because I don't necessarily agree with the vlogging lifestyle um, for, you know, the whole what you see in front of the camera is not what it's like behind the scenes. And I think that, that can be very toxic and very damaging. Obviously, protecting identities and keeping some things private is one thing, but fabricating your existence for the benefit of a vlog is an entirely different story, and I don't agree with it. That's not completely what's going on here, but it definitely touches upon that as a concept. Basically, what you see is not necessarily what you get, and what looks like a happy family dynamic may not be the case. So I like the message. I do. And I like the creativity. But the narrative, the way they decided to spread this message, just wasn't very good at all. So it's not the worst episode ever. As a change of pace, it's not too bad. But as I said, once the novelty wore off, it became really dull. And I'd say it took maybe five minutes at the most for the novelty to wear off. So it's not great, but it is relatable in ways. I think a lot of people share a lot of feelings that some of the characters in this express. But beyond that... I didn't really care for it. My life as a vlog is definitely not a brilliant episode.